Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's Nicole, and today we're going to go over my $1,000 Christmas savings plan. This is linked down in the description, completely free. It's just a Google Doc. You can print it out if you want to do this with me. If you do plan on doing it, just let me know. I think that would be awesome if I wasn't alone in doing this, but let's go ahead and go over it. So this is the jar that I plan on using. It's just a twist off lid. Um, I have done different things with my savings challenges. I've done like using a soda bottle or using a wine bottle. The soda bottle, you can end up getting money out if you want. I used to do it to like count it because I was curious. I didn't end up ever taking anything out. So that's good. I had the willpower for that. And then the wine bottle was literally impossible to get any money out. Um, so if you're someone who tends to dip into like cash if you have it on hand, definitely use a wine bottle. Um, it's literally impossible to get out unless you smash it, which is what I did at the end. And then um, for this one, I'm just using this bottle. Um, it's a test to, it's not a bottle, it's a jar, but it's a test to my willpower. And I have faith that I'll <laughs> be able to get through it. But let me go ahead and talk about the different amounts on here. So this is starting next paycheck, which for me, since I get paid Tuesdays, it's going to start on February 2nd, I believe. Um, so first paycheck of February is when I'll be starting it. And there should be 47 weeks until Christmas um, at that time. So there's 47 different boxes on here. For me, I get paid weekly, so I'm just going to have to fill in one box. If you get paid bi-weekly, then you'll need to fill in two boxes but you can choose whatever amount works for you. I know for me, sometimes I have a great week on DoorDash and I can put in, you know, the $80, but other times I'm really struggling, but I account for this by putting, you know, the $1 or the $4 or $6, $5, $3. There's so many different choices, even $2. Like there's so many different choices that you can do in order to make it fit with your budget at the time. We all have, you know, different weeks where, you know, something comes up, we don't have the money, but I count for that in this by putting, you know, the $1, like I said. If you start this late, you can go ahead and fill in a couple more boxes. If you want the money earlier, say like for Black Friday, say just try to fill in the bigger boxes, like the 50s and the 20s and the 80 and the 30s. And that way you can have more money saved by the time Black Friday rolls around. Or if you want to do like three boxes one week just to get yourself to the date when you need that money by. For me personally, I always have, I have money that I need by Black Friday, but then I also will continue to buy gifts up until like two days before Christmas. That's always how it works out for me. So there won't be a time where I'll be counting all thousand dollars unless I have like a great week and I want to finish it early, which happened my last um, time I did something like this. My last savings plan for Christmas was only 700 and I had a shorter amount of time to save it. So this one is really going to be a chill savings plan that's not going to hurt me too much um, to do. So I'm looking forward to that. Now I'm just going to wrap it around this jar and tape it and then I'll show you what the final looks like. So here is what the final looks like. It's completely covered. And since the construction paper didn't go all the way around, I just put two extra pieces here. Um, just for me, I just like when it's completely covered, but that's not gonna be showing. Uh, it's only gonna be the front that's showing here. So basically all you do is you pick an amount and then you color it in. I like to use highlighters so I can still see the numbers. And then once this entire thing is filled up it'll be the week of christmas and you'll also have a thousand dollars if you like this idea please give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing i make new videos every week whether it be cash envelope stuffing or different savings challenges or opening up my different savings challenges um, there's always a new video every week so please subscribe and i'll see you guys next week